Plural marriage is challenging, it just is. Before COVID, Cody was splitting his time equally. You know that when you're a plural wife, you get messed up in your head and you don't realize you're, you're, tra you're not tracking it as well. It really seems that Robin's main focus in season 17 is gaslighting the shit out of her fellow sister wives by refuting their recantations of history and telling them that it's because they're such crappy wives that they can't keep a reliable account of how Cody spends his time. If being a good sister wife includes supporting your other sister wives, then Robin is is one of the worst sister wives of all time. Let's discuss. Hey everyone, what's up? It's Sarah and welcome back to my channel. So Robin and Cody, especially Robin, seem to be on this really bizarre PR campaign that involves this insistence that Cody is super busy giving equal time to all of his wives and all of his households. We have seen time and time again, Mary, Janelle, and Christine all comment on the time inequality and blatant favoritism. We've even seen outside non-family members comment on it. Remember in season eight, the anthropology students called out that Cody does not spend his time equally. Frankly, it just does not make sense to me that Robin is so insistent that Cody actually does spend his time equally divided between the four houses. Cause like Rob's, my girl, if Cody is not at your house and you're thinking or assuming he's at the other houses, then girl, I think you opened up a whole other can of worms. So we have Mary talk about and Cody has confirmed that Mary is out of the rotation because Cody and Mary have said bye-bye a long time ago to their intimate relationship. I mean, back at the beginning of season 16, Cody didn't even know that Leo and Audrey left after quarantining at Mary's house for a couple weeks to go run the B&B. This was documented on camera, so I mean, it's really irrefutable. Then we have Janelle, who apparently told Cody to stay away at the beginning of the pandemic, which I feel like she should have included her children in on that before making such a unilateral decision, but so be it. Garrison and Gabriel said that someone could literally have gotten pregnant and had a child in the amount of time it's been since they've last seen their dad. And Janelle never says that her boys are wrong. She's just constantly telling us how much she doesn't keep tabs on Cody because that's just not her style. And in this current season, she does affirm the preference that Cody has for Robin and Robin's house and that it has been this way since Las Vegas. And then we have Christine. Christine, who has said from literal day one, season one, the beginning of the series, that she has had a problem with the way Cody favors Robin. And time and time again, Christine has requested even demanded that Cody show up and be present more for her kids. Cody couches this as Christine demanding more than the other households are getting, but that's just not true. I mean, literally, Christine requested for help putting her kids to bed while she went out and worked at night. That really is not a big ask. So we have Cody admits that he doesn't see Mary except for really like family functions and maybe an occasional phone call. But we're supposed to believe that literally Janelle and Christine and every member of their household is lying about the amount of time that Cody spends there. I think given what we've seen historically and even having non-family members comment on the blatant favoritism, this scenario is just highly unlikely. And what I have found especially appalling and disappointing 
is that Robin claims that the reason why the wives are having such problems recounting how much time Cody is actually there is because they're struggling in their relationship. To me, though, it would be like if you were having a struggling relationship, wouldn't the times he was there stick out really clearly in your memory? I don't know. This just must be some vast conspiracy. Everybody else is wrong. Cody and Robin are right. I mean, come on. In episode one of season 17, Robin says that the only way to be successful at plural marriage is to support your sister wife's marriage. But by refuting and invalidating their lived experiences, that is the opposite of supportive. As a matter of fact, it further bolsters Cody's delusion that he is upholding his responsibilities as a father and the vows that he made when he became a husband to all these women. Cody's children that are not from Robin are learning the harsh reality that biology does not necessarily a family make. Sometimes the people that are supposed to show up for you don't. And in the end, family is what you make it. Personally, I think Janelle and Christine are doing a fantastic job of keeping all of their kids close and a solid family unit. All of their kids are still so connected and involved with each other's lives. It's really nice to see. The kids are now growing up, they're starting their own families, and they're living by the example and the values that their mothers have shown them. Growing up, they're becoming thriving adults in spite of Cody, not because of him. Robin says Cody is more and more angry every day and he is becoming extremely difficult to live with. I mean, if she is just sitting there, just, just agreeing with everything Cody says, affirming all of his BS and his delusions, that's only gonna escalate the divide between Cody and the other households, meaning he's only gonna get more angry the longer he's at your house. And I don't know, I would think that that probably is going to be even less fun to live with. Robin knows deep down when push comes to shove, Cody does not spend anywhere near an equal amount of time with all of his other households. And she is just wrong for backing Cody on this. And she's also wrong for wanting her sister wives to just stay miserable. In the season 16 tell-all, she refused to acknowledge that Christine and Cody were divorced even though that is how Christine describes their relationship. Robin left a marriage where she says she was mistreated. How can she sit there and wish that life for one of her sister wives just in the quest to be the favorite wife. In my opinion, it's just really messed up. And I feel like if Cody in Robin's household was blatantly favoring one of Robin's kids, Robin would never put up with that. She just doesn't carry that same energy for the rest of her family. Let me know what you guys think down in the comments. Make sure you like this video, subscribe to my channel, follow me on Instagram and Twitter at Reality Squad, and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Take care. Have a good one. Much love.